Yo, what is going on? Not sure who's up in here, but uh, Napoleon, I see you here. Maybe you hopped out for a little bit. Who knows? But we're getting right into it. We're getting right into it, whether I'm playing these games by myself or not. Yeah. You know what I don't have today? Schnacks. I got no schnacks. Oh, shit. Here we go again. Bro, Mark, what up, bro? What up, player? Smashing them legs today? Huh? Crazy bastard? Oh, Michael, what up? Sponsibilities. Damn, bro. Sponsibilities. Oh, Tris, what's up? Was cooking good looking? Yo, Tris, did you try Once Human? Not sure if you heard about that. I played it the other day. I don't know if Spec told you about it. It's basically another PAL world. Or whatever, another survival type of game like that. Switch up the routine. What you doing now, bro? My legs are exploding right now. So what are you doing? Responsibilities, Mike. Responsibilities, man. And we're live. And we're live. Yo, butter, what's the deal? Responsibilities, man, they suck, but you know, it's what keeps life going, baby. Yo, butter, make sure you don't die like me 50 million times. Wait, what checkpoint is that? That's a bug, right? Yeah, that's a bug. Rosario Village has been turned into a cartel Actually, I could go. Camp. Maybe Search I could go fourth. For intel on the prisoners who've been held there. All right, let's. Uh, the lead on the disappearances. Which is ju 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 responsibilities. When you want to play video game responsibilities. All right, no more of this. Let's get rid of that. And uh, we'll put on a little, a little hat. A little hattity hat hat. No, let's just rock this for a little bit. Why not? And um, let's take this off of these guys. All right, here we go. We're back at it. We're back at it. We're back. Holy shit, Tris. With the 33 month showing love, do no busy 33 months. I mean, the love, the absolute love and support I get to try to get this thing up and running. And it's a grind, people. It's a grind. But you know what? You're here for it. I'm here for it. I fucking appreciate it so much. She said, no, what's that? So just YouTube once human or Google it and check it out. I don't know if you can still sign up for the beta right now, Tris. But first of all, if you're still here, shout out to you with the 33 months showing love. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> drop those, drop those GMOGs, baby. Much appreciated. Man, got a little, a little tear in my eye. Gots to wipe it off. I feel special, man. I feel special. Yo, Jelly, what up? But uh, yeah, Tris, so check it out. It's basically, it's the same shit like Power World. It's just, it's a little more serious. So like in Power World, if you were tired of basically like fighting those types of bad guys, this has like zombies 
It has kind of like monsters and aliens. It's like shit. It's it's basically like that. It's a little more realistic, so you could YouTube it. I don't know, like I said, if you could still do the beta right now. I had signed up for it a few days back, and then I played it for a couple days. Hmm. Yo, Napoleon. Nah, yo, don't worry about that, bro. It's good to have you here, brother. Oh man, so uh, I guess we uh, we could start bucking some heads. We could start uh, taking down. Who do we have here? We don't even know. Oh, it's that dude, right? What's his name? Uh. Oh no, we got him. Who am I thinking of? Oh, this dude. Yeah, but what's his name? I know what he looks like. I'll yeah, Tris, check it out. I don't know if he's still playing Power World or not. Um. Or if you're kind of tired of it, if you want something a little more serious. Power World has a special charm to it that I felt like this game didn't really have at, at, at first. Like, the charm is kind of missing that Power World really had. So, but you can check it out, see if you like it. Especially if, like, you're really into those types of games. Like, are you still playing? Tris, what's the one game that came out right after Power World? Enshrouded? I think it was Enshrouded, right? Are you still playing Enshrouded, or did that kind of like, did, did that fall off? I called the Rebels for a diversion. Copy that, Janky. We've got a fire team moving there now. Hey, sniper on the roof. No contact me. Just spotted one with submachine guns. Let's go, boys. Get in there and cause cause some havoc. Put the hornet's nest. Get off that. No, nah, you're not getting on that. Kill this guy. Oh, that's about to blow up. Oh, oh, schnips. It's sure not having touched it. We hit cap. Oh, so you bit. Oh, shit. Oh, so you hit cap and basically, like, nah, you're good. What about Power World? Are you still playing Power World? I haven't hopped on Power World probably until like since I played with you and Spec. It's been a minute since I hopped on Power World. There might World. be some intel around here. But the, like the the thing about this game, it was clean. Like like the combat, the animations were clean. The bad guys were weird. It has like you have like a machete and you could like you could. I kill people like that, so. But. You know, something about Power World was it was fun. It was like kind of addicting in the beginning. This game kind of didn't have that. Yo, let me ask you something. You miss my hair? <laughs> hey, you're not the only one who misses it. But, uh, as is life. You know, I'm getting older, the air, the hair is thinning out, and, uh, you know, I just don't want to deal with it anymore. So, uh, I tell you what, let me ask you something. When you hit the lottery, you could drop me a fat dono bomb, and I'll fly to Turkey, and I'll get, I'll get, um, hair transplants, and I'll document all of it, and I'll put it on my channel. How's, how's that sound? But you gotta hit the, you gotta hit the lotto, bro, you gotta hit the lotto. Because it's, it's like, it's like, cost, it costs a penny. It costs a hot penny. Still at Power Arcade, but Spec has been playing Hell Divers. Yeah, so Hell Divers is not, not your cup of tea. Right? It's, that's, that's too much. That's too much. Yeah. Yo, he hit, yo, Tris, he hits me up. He's like, yo, Hell Divers, Hell Divers, and I'm either out, I'm at my girl's. Or I'm or I'm hopping on this to do this. I gotta I gotta make a date with Spec to do a Helldiver stream. Maybe after 
After I beat this, we'll do a little hell divers before I hop into the next thing. I'll get you that Elon Musk transfer with the buke with that buku money. Hell yeah, bro. Hell yeah, that's what I'm talking about. That's what that's what we need. We need that the the Elon Musk makeover, dude. That man went from zero to hero once his ticket hit. No, you're not on, Weaver. You're the exact opposite of being on. Oh. This mission. Okay. I'll be damned. The cartel just put up a wall and turned the whole village into a prison. I kind of wish Pal World... Same as before. Get inside, like, they're doing the updates and shit, but I wish they'd update their animations. The, the Tris, if you're still walls. here, the one, the one good thing about the Once Human... Is like when you're chopping a tree, you're, it actually like like the animations are really good for everything, and like the fighting and the running, like it doesn't have the like this like the same animation for everything. All right, so I do not have a good weapon for this. We're gonna have to range this. Alarm is off. Ooh, shot his ankles. I mean, I mean, you know what we could do? Now, nah, let's try to take out a lot more guys before we even send in rebels. I know they got, they have mortars. They might even have a second. Oh, look at this guy up here. Oh man, that guy is really up there. Let's see. Oh my God, what a shot. You guys probably can't even see that. Hey, squad gaming. What's up, bro? Try to get out of our early place. Somebody drove through the wall. A good one. How to fix it and board it up. What the hell is going on over there, bro? Drunk, crazy people. I can barely see this guy. Oh, my God. Oh, caught him. I'm moving to position. I'm engaging tangles. Oh, here we go. They've seen us. Move position. Yo, Cody, what up? <clears throat> Goodwill run took longer than I expected due to car troubles. What I miss? Ah, uh, so we just started, bro. We just started. You didn't miss. You missed nada. Only thing you missed was this beautiful face. So. Oh shit. So yeah, we're just, we're getting up in here. We gotta locate the warden's computer. Yeah, because we're not in that position, buddy. We uh we're hitting and moving. Shooting and grooving. We are out of there. Oh, 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 look at the beautiful sun move. Look at this. Oh, look, it's so smooth, man. It's so smooth. Look at that. Man, that's sexy. Look at that shot right there. Wow. That that beautiful or what? Look at that. Ghost Recon Wildlands. All right, let me not get shot. Doing some cinematic shit. It's getting quiet over there. They must think we left. Oh, that's right. That's the side I always, I always come from. I got eyes and a sniper. Oh. Oh, there we go. Woof. All, right, All he saw were bullets flying past his head. Yeah. 
I don't think so, buddy. Is there another one over there? Who's headed this way, man? Pinpointing my location like that, bro? I don't believe it. Yeah, tell your boys. Tell your boys to come over here. Shut up. Got more peeps? Got more peeps? I'm surprised they heard me from over here. That one guy got killed, but I guess maybe they were close enough to hear the shots. No, sir. Yeah, there's nothing here. Just a bunch of dead Sicarios, baby. That's all we have. Spot. Yeah, those idiots. Ooh. All right, keep coming, boys. Keep coming. Let's see. Let's make sure we got some good cover in case there's a firefight. Oof. Frag out. I want to drop a I want to drop a mortar on these guys heads Deploying drone Damn look at this dude booking it Oh wait is, is that Weaver? I can't even tell bro Call Pakatori for some reinforcements Copy a fire team has been sent to your 20 Boom! Oh man, they spawned. They should not have spawned right there. That was a bad place for them to spawn. I need cover, man. This is not good. I'm out in the open. Your face, your face is gone. Where, where, where? Good job, Holt. I don't, I can't tell if you're a bad guy or not with 50 of them around me. Fuck out of here, bro. What are you, what are you doing? Let's go, Rebels. We're in, some, we're, in a, we're in some shit now, boys. I only have 20 rounds left. This is not good. This might be a failed op. Might be a failed op, boys. Alright, we're gonna flank all the way around. That's what we're doing. We're flanking all the way around. Yeah, <laughs> yo, Speck, well, ain't no recon that can ghost you. Uh, yo, uh, ready or not, I, yo, I gotta be honest, man, I, I'm not really that hyped about ready or not. Half the game, like, the gameplay's cool, but, like, the AI's, the AI's cool, it's nice, but then you're walking through these boards, I don't want to tell guys to get on the floor, I just want to shoot everybody. But I think I'll have to do a ready or not playthrough eventually. Yo, for real, A Squad, work is for losers. Get with it, bro. Let me go into my. Let me go to my backpack. Put on my navigation gaggers.
20 rounds left. 20 rounds left. Dude, I thought that was a bad guy. I am... Wow, I cannot see. Holy shit. I could have sworn that was a bad guy. I'm bugging, dude. And look at this guy booking it's gotta be weird <laughs> why did it have to be weird yo he was the fastest one bro what do you think well to me g money watches mozart as i live and breathe yo mark what up mark hughes 18 rounds left ready not to rare gem of an indie tag shooter to be i'm not just into cop stuff like yeah i mean yeah like the whole swat thing i feel like Rainbow Six did it better back in the day, but that's just old people talk. I'll, I'll get it eventually. I just, yo, honestly, if there's a good sale on it, maybe I'll get it. I'm not spending 50 bucks on that. Like, like there's just no way I'm spending $50 on that game. Move there. Roger that. Let's try to get a diversion in the middle of the base. Clear over here. Yo, Matt, what's up? It might not be a tactical shot for you, but they're all tactical shots for me. Even if I can't see half the enemies, because I'm blind. I'm blind. That guy definitely came out to try to look for us. Damn, who the hell said that? We rattled somebody's cage. Yeah, I think we just got too close. Well, we might as well shoot this out now. That was the last alarm. Was it? Alright, that's good. We're good, we're good. I think the whole base came out, bro. I gotta be honest, bro. I think the whole base up oh, I'm wrong. Two Sicarios. Over that, there. That guy. That, that guy's still there. You know, go right there. I copy. Oh, 15 shots. I got 15 rounds left. Got to use them wisely. Got to use them wisely. Target's marked. Standing by for go order. First of all, you guys are not... There you go. Okay, I see you now. Alright, good. What is that up there? What... <clears throat> Actually, let's just... Let's just use our cojones and go get it, whatever it may be. Just go, baby. Just go, baby. There's a cartel metal over here. Let's see what this is. Stable aim. I don't need no stable aim. My aim is stable enough. I got the most stablest aim of all the stable aims, baby. Oh my god. Flammable explosives everywhere. Um, wait. <clears throat> trying to, trying to remember where this, this was at. Oof. Hang back, that tango might spot you. Oh, I don't see him. Is it in there? Mm, mm, might be. Number five. Damn. My trigger fingers too triggery. Two rounds. Let's grab some ammo. Yes. Yes. 
We're good to go now, boys. We're good to go now. We got a PC over here. There's a record of the prison. Okay. It's here. Nice. No time to be choosy. We'll download every document. Download started. Weaver's <laughs> always catching strays. He de Yo, Margaret, he deserves it. He deserves it. There's something here we can use. Uh, I forget. I think I have to go this way, actually. All right, we're out. We're out. We did that lickety split. Well, I don't know about lickety split, but we definitely uh, took our time with that one and um, got out safe. A Bolivian journalist named Lupe Vera has been investigating. Oh, this chick. Okay. Months. Track her down and find out what she knows. Oh man, these guys are. Oof, he was just patrolling, bro, by himself. Caught a couple. Five, five, six, right in the head. Well, thank you for the automobile. Don't mind if I do. I don't mind if I do. I can, bro. Yeah, yo, yo, Hughes, he doesn't help himself, bro, especially knowing what we know with Breakpoint, he just, he deserves it. He deserves all the ridicule in the world. Uh, you know what? Might as well go grab my chopper. So we are chipping away already in San Mateo. I gotta open my window. I'm on. Sweating. Oh, baby, 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 baby. We're coming up on the journalist's last known location. Let's track her down and find out what she knows about the missing people. We gotta figure the cartels around. Looking for her, too. What's up, bro? Hola, camaradas. What do you want, gringo? We're looking for a journalist named Lupe Vera. So are we, but it's too late. The cartel has her. They've taken her back to their base. You planning a rescue? Yes, but it would be suicide. The outpost is heavily guarded, and I don't have enough troops. You do now. We need to get the Vera, whatever it takes. Then let's go. We haven't got much time. Anden, hermanos. Let's go. Okay. So, the main question every time we save this chick is Does she know a little bit too much? And who is she working for? And is this a setup? Fire. I have a shot. Engage. I copy. Target down. I'm pretty sure there's point. Yep. Oh, 
Gracias. Fucking hell, it's good to be free. Whoa, 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 whoa. Language, language, language. But I don't know if I'll stay with journalism after this shit. Oh, how convenient. How convenient, huh? Just when you get, you get, you know, knee deep in shit and what everything's going on and everything that you've learned, now all of a sudden you don't want to be a journalist anymore, huh? That's awfully convenient. Yo, Jacob Powell, what up, what up? Some officers torture and murder innocents and then send the evidence here to be destroyed. Santa Blanca kills people all the time and leaves the... The hideout is just ahead. Good. Show us that intel on the people disappearing in San Mateo. We need to put a stop to it. Hola. It's not hard to guess that Los Desaparecidos, the disappeared, have all been murdered. I've got notes on some truck the cartel uses to pick up the bodies. It's supposed to have a regular route like a fucking... The mission briefs, service. you like that they're not long, That's but they're a little superficial at times. Schedule. Nothing specific. I mean, oh, yeah, amigo, this was hard enough better than Breakpoint. I just know that the truck's last... They need better, better riders, especially if they want to keep the Tom Clancy brand. Yeah, that's true. That is definitely true. Photograph the journalist's notes. I do think that they need a specific type of writer for these franchises. What about my story? There are dozens of families, hundreds, who need answers to what happened to their loved ones. When we get answers, you'll be the one to spread the word. Adios. And gracias. We got a fucking man down. You're gonna be alright, you hear me? Good I'm to go. on the way. Woo! Got out of there just in the nick of time, baby. Just in the nick of time. The cartel keeps its high value prisoners at a camp up in the mountains called La Carcel del Pueblo. Liberate the prisoners and find out what they know about the disappearances. While in service decent, I don't know why I got a bad rep. Yeah, it was, it was, it was. It was. Yo, Jay, what up? Eagle, what up? Good Jay. Simply don't understand authenticity. <laughs> Danger Close is the most authentic line I've ever heard. Any writer that actually does political spy espionage books, that would help. That would definitely help. But then you need it. You also need a development team to bring it home. You know? Like... Like... Because then the story could be amazing, and if the mechanics are, are gaka, it's like, you know? Like, imagine Breakpoint had an amazing story, but then you're running around grabbing colorful loot. Like, it still, it still ruins the entire aspect of the game. Got an alarm. Shut the damn alarm off. Oh, I can't see this one. Oh, jeez. Oh, great. Yeah! And I guess, yo, also, we also have to understand, yo, dude. You know, Ubisoft might try to hold on to these IPs for as long as they can before they just abandon them because... Yo, the core audience of these games, we're like, we're getting old. And it's not a it's not an entire spectrum of demographics that buy these games, bro. Like it's it's just it's mostly it's mostly older guys who play this. So we take out the Jenny. We gotta find it first. Come on. The alarm is disabled. I got eyes on a generator. Jenny's down. Those cell doors must be unlocked. Let's talk to one of these prisoners. See what we can find out about the disappearances. There are some light panels here. Hey, sniper on the roof. 
Oh shit, they are fighting already? I call the rebels for oh, the might as well get up in there. Man, these guys are getting blasted. We poke the hornet's nest. I'm calling for indirect fire. Eat that! Eat that! Boom, baby, boom, baby, boom! Don't die, G. Don't die. We searching this location for it. They're on alert. That was ballsy. What's up, brother? Hey, I need your help with something. We've been trying to figure out what happens. Yo, to Keegan, what's up? Here in San Mateo. What happens to them is El Pozolero. The story is the yeah. most important part to the show. To tactical Where fans don't really care for the story. It's the open world crowd. They care about the good story to fill the massive empty yeah. world. Bro, that's just yo, where Eagle, where do you come up with this shit, bro? Cause that shit is just not true. Nobody you just you just prove you just said like the first part of your statement is exactly right. Like, as long as the game as long as that game loop is solid, that's really what people are looking for. But then like yo, you yo, y'all are on like a manhunt. You and Jay are on this manhunt. Like you now, so you want to tie together people who like the open world with people who like the story to fill the massive empty world like yo you basically Lie. you're basically just Cross making shit up soda. at that See, point like where like where would you even get that never on the forums the did people advocate for that no not, not on not on so not on the youtube community of people advocating for that the way to go after him he's the only one who can lead us to any of the remains like oh yeah as long as we have a good story that's all we want where do you get that shit from is there anything on El Pozolero? We've got a description of the truck that makes his regular deliveries, but nothing on the truck's route or its schedule. The gameplay is what made the game excellent. The gameplay is what makes all games excellent. Like I said, yo, I don't like. Imagine if Breakpoint had a great story. Yo, that game still would have sucked. I'm sending it to you now. Get your mitts on the driver and make him tell you his final destination. That's where all the remains. I'm just trying to. I'm just trying to figure out like like. Like it's like it's a straw man, you know what I'm saying? Like you just straw man that whole, that whole chat right there. Because I think I think, in my opinion, if it's the one thing that. The Clancy community yearns for is straight crack gameplay because if you look like if you look at all the old school games that got everybody into all the Clancy games none of them were like huge story driven games nice. look at um yo look at Splinter Cell like I feel like Splinter Cell is a perfect example Splinter Cell's entire game is the story is just driven by Lambert in your ear as you're as you're going through these these levels maybe a quick little cutscene at the end like how old school games did it but yo that was it and Splinter Cell was crack why yo because the gameplay was amazing you guys need a good story to enjoy the game I just want good gameplay yeah that's what I'm saying bro that's exactly what I said like no nobody nobody wants that nobody wants a good story to enjoy the game Everybody wants good. Everybody wants a good game loop. I'll fly. Which is why I said if Breakpoint had a great story, that shit would still it still would have got shit on. I don't know, bro. According to our I don't know. There's a cartel. I think y'all. I think y'all are on like a rampage. And delivers them to someone called El Pozolero. Oh shit. The truck and oh shit. The to give up oh El shit. It's driven by clans and milsim forms, yeah, Cody. But I think I I think 
Clancy games, like as long as you have a good grounded story, that's all that's really required. You don't need to, like, what they did with Breakpoint, trying to, like, Witcher 3, Assassin's Creed, that shit, with this having choices that the choices don't even matter, and then, like, yo, none of that shit matters, dude. Really? The lieutenant's trying to escape. Get that idea, uh, though. I'm unarmed! I'm unarmed! We're clear. Okay, okay, okay. Damn, Rindo. I'm having 20. Yeah, of course. Of course. Of course, of course you're having 20 tacos, bro. I just drive the truck. Wait, a single player co op experience kind of requires a story. I mean, I think I think games require stories, of course. I don't agree with Eagle that if the story is good, that's all that's required from, 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 from let's see, uh, you guys need a good story to enjoy the game. I don't, I don't think anybody is going to enjoy a bad game that has a good story. Oh, shit. He also gave up Puzzolero's location. Outstanding. I'll run Mario's name and send you whatever background I can find. This one's weird, Bob. These cartels are just staying away from El Puzzolero like he's got the plague. Oof. That might be why there's such little chatter about him. Be careful. There's a lot of unknowns here. Just make sure he's alive. Otherwise, we'll never get confirmation on these missing people. Like, in my opinion, same thing for Wildlands. Right? The majority of it is pushed by Bowman in your ear with a nice cutscene that kind of furthers the story after you capture each boss. Good enough. Good enough. Just got a file transfer from Bowman. Looks like she was able to dig up some background on El Pozolero. John Carmack, the story only needs only needs to like be it. there. Yeah. I have no idea what we're walking into. I'm getting like tense, you know? Kinda like a little nervous. What you just uh you just saw uh an old video with him? Carmack is wise. Yes. Wait, we're up, we're up to him already? Oh my god. Damn. Bang this shit out, boys. Don't destroy the truck. We need what's inside. Opening fire. Say the word. Don't hit the truck. We need to destroy the truck. We're on our vehicle. I'm on for the ride. Oh my Let's god, it's fucking door. game, bro. Shit got close for a second there. It's fucking game, bro. I swear, dude. Such bullshit. I saw that happen in slow mo, bro. Oh yeah, we got your helicopter. Dude, it's top 10 game ever and it still holds up. He's the best programmer ever in gaming, gangsta. You ever see the video? I think it was, yeah, it was, was it the Doom video? There's a good programming video where they had, they show like a part of his, part of the code that he wrote. And I forget what, where did, where the hell is that chopper? Oh my God, all the way over there. All right, you're bugging, bro. Um... Yeah, with something like, oh man, I want to find it now. I forget what the code was for, and it showed like he he wrote the code and it made it like super fast or some shit. I don't play Ghost Recon Rainbow Six because I want to listen to his story again. Yeah, I mean, I'll be honest, dude. Even story-driven games, man, they're they're. They're tough, man. They're tough to get to go through. You go through them once and it's like, all right, that's enough. I'm done. Can't go through that again. I have no interest in playing Last of Us as good as story and mediocre gameplay. Yeah, honestly, Jay, what, with what I just said, that was exactly what I was thinking of. That type of game. 
Like, it's just, um, it, to, come on, bro, stop. To experience it once, you know, I enjoy it. I, I played the, um, Buckle up, people. what was that, uh, All right, let's roll. that DLC that I bought to stream that one day. Like, that was, a, that was the last time I had played it since I streamed it from, like, years prior. Well, my chopper is up there. Maybe I should go get it. Must have caught the power line. You know, <laughs> that's, that's the logic we'll, uh, we'll use for that Napoleon. That's that's how we'll we'll pretend that's what happened. Yo, the hand, what's up? Breakpoint story was hideous. Terrible, dude. Terrible. The not only was the story hideous, the entire Oh man, this is dangerous. Coming up on the cartel base now. Let's go find El Pozolero. The entire um like design aspect, like that Assassin's Creed type of story design, which I feel like they just got from The Witcher 3. Like I'm not I'm really not a fan. I, I don't understand why as a developer you would create more you create more work for your writers, and it means absolutely nothing. It's like, here is here is a choice. There are three options. Pick one. It's like, okay, where is this going to lead? Nowhere. It all leads to the same thing. So why even have choices? Just spit out a freaking... Spit out some dialogue and keep it moving. I don't need three choices to hear something different, and it leads me to the same place. That's actually... I don't... Did I do an Assassin's Creed thing online? Did I ever stream that before? Yo, Assassin's Creed Odyssey had a, a story creator mode. And you could actually... It was limited in what you could do as far as designing, like putting enemies on the map and everything. But you could actually have your choices in your dialogue lead to different circumstances. And I'm like, yo, if we could do this on this, why don't they do it in the game? Oh shit, I'm basically stuck here, aren't I? I got one narco by the helipad. Why isn't there a tacticalist RPG yet? Um, because they don't know how to make the RPG mechanics for the TAC shooter genre. So if you look at something like Breakpoint, or or even, I guess, Wildlands, whatever, but Breakpoint more, it's like they want to take fantasy RPG elements and try to shove it into attack shooter instead of taking elements for attack shooter and trying to create those types of mechanics for it. Which, I mean, I think they could figure it out. They're, they weren't that far off with, with these. I mean, really, when you think of it. It just, I mean, I think they could do a better job. And then it all depends. They fucking, you know, they make games by committee, you know? And it's like, and then they try to figure out. Where'd that guy go? All right, we're all clear. They try to figure out what's going to work for... For the players, they're trying to uh, draw into the franchise, into the game. I mean, I don't know, man. It gets to the point where where things were botched so much that that even like normal Joe schmoes like us are like, why didn't you just do this? And it's completely, it's a completely valid opinion. It's not like so it's not like the majority of uh gamers with game dev where it's like do this, do this, do this, and it's just like people asking for ridiculous things. It's like, no, that would be stupid. 
It's like, hey, can we have a, a ground attack shooter with better ballistics and, you know, maybe the ability to do A, B, and C, and it it's all relative to basically what 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 we would expect in a shooter. And it's like, nah, here's tiered loot and fucking robots. It's like, whatever. Eyes up, we got hostiles in the area. Watch your fire. We don't want to hit any civilians. Yo, Stiggy Wiggy. What's up, bro? This game would have been epic if this map was uh, third or first person with original Ghost Recon seriousness and not feel like GTA. I think, I think a big problem with where they took the open world was the fact that they kept, as, as they, I guess, kept creating, whether it was Future Soldier, Wildlands, and then Breakpoint, they just got, they got like further and further away with keeping it an actual tactical shooter. And, you know, you got guys, you got guys here who, yo, that's all they want. They just want a legitimate tactical shooter for Ghost Recon. And so hopefully the next game uh, will provide that, but we have to wait and see. I think Wildlands, I think Wildlands was a good, was a good start for the open world, but I don't know, I don't know what they did with Breakpoint. Like, they kind of, they, they lost me with Breakpoint. They had a good, they had a good base, in my opinion, with Wildlands. They had a good base game with, uh, like, mechanics. They just had to, like, touch up really some ballistic issues, some AI spawning issues. What's a shot? Oh! Yo, you know, yo, Lucko, what up? Breakpoint should have never gone with the future, uh, futuristic building and drones would have been cool with a ravished world. Yes, Diggy. I think uh, we were talking about that yesterday. Like, how good would have Breakpoint have been if, like, the game world was just not as freaking generic? Oh, good, okay. You know, it's just so generic, dude. The says thing that we can list off dozens of things that were removed from the series. Am I disappointed in first person new over? Totally agree with the ghost tactical third person. I mean, that's gonna be that's gonna be subjective. Like I know, like Jay, Jay is definitely a, a first person fan. So if the game is good, he'll probably be happy. Um, I do agree. I'm more of a, a third person fan, especially. Uh, Two Especially if the, the animations are really good around. and the mechanics Remember and the character feels grounded to the to the world, it, it's from my opinion it's really hard to create games like that. But uh, you know we'll we'll see what they end up doing. Things that people want and are good for the game. I want it less for kids and more for hardcore fans. Be brutal with gruesome kills. Well, Stiggy, I think I think the gruesome kills across the board works even for kids. Obviously, you know, a lot of these games are rated, you know, M17, but the problem is, is that, you know, you want the games to sell. So I think that's the problem with a lot of these Ghost Recon games is that, I mean, not even Ghost Recon, the problem with a lot of the Clancy uh, games, whether it's Splinter Cell, Rainbow, and Ghost Recon, they're, they're like, they're trying to innovate and appeal to i guess new audiences and everything but then they end up not appealing to anybody the og fans or new audiences and the games they you know they don't do well i don't think extraction did well at all where is that guy look at this guy Thought he was a bad guy there for a second. <clears throat> the 
Jerry Skull like to see my look. Yeah, me too. About money about yeah less about pleasing fans yeah that's what it is yo you need to sell i actually i think i said it um yesterday in yesterday's stream i wish that they would just give us the games we want and then let them fail on their own accord because then at least i could turn around and say look this is the game this is the exact type of game i want and it and it's not selling so at that point it's like all right what are you gonna do? I'm, uh, you know, I can't be the target audience on, on anymore if I'm the only one buying the game. Me and three other freaking old ass guys, you know. You be abandoning that game, but start another alien event in siege, <laughs> bro. These guys, bro. That game was caca, bro. And yo, and even then, right? You play Extraction, and it's like, hey, sniper on the roof. You play Extraction and you shoot the aliens and they just kind of disappear. Like, it's not even like they made it a good alien game in my opinion. There's no gore, there's no guts shooting aliens' limbs off. You think you'd take advantage at that point of like, all right, we're killing aliens. We could at least make it to where, you know, we're shooting, we're shooting these guys in their blood and guts everywhere. It's just like, I don't know, it was so, it was cheesy, dude. Oh man, that guy's way too far. I didn't shoot this one? I didn't shoot this? I don't even see it. Can't see it on the other side. I don't know. By the checkpoint? Nah, that shit is done. Wait, so... I missed an alarm, I just don't... I'm not sure where he was saying that. Yo, I got a weapons case here. I'd rather play Check's Quest and play, uh... Oh, then play Extraction? That sounded insulting to uh, CQ. Uh, that's a good game. <laughs> yeah, Extraction, man, was... Uh, I don't know how that shit got, got the green light, bro. Like, how they green lit that shit, man. You guys smell that? Christ. Come on, you can do it. I believe in you. Arriba. Let me see those hands. Hola, senores. You're taller than the usual delivery people. <laughs> All right. Everybody in. Let's go. Come on. Come on, boys. Let's go. Let's go.
Inside, inside. Let's go. Nice. Actually, Paul should be able to get in the back. Whatever. If we're staying overnight, I should probably have me. Oh, there's the other alarm right like there. Teddy bear? Oh, it's not what you think. I'm not overly afraid of the dark, but Pepito will think I'm cheating on him. Media Flores once gave me a hit up. I replayed The Last of Us and Part 2 multiple times. Oh, wow, Matt. Part 1, I played all three platforms and, and bought the remastered version. My part is supposed to be about a game that was free in cereal boxes and funded by a serial company is better than a game made decades later by Ubisoft. No insult was intended against EQ. Some of the other men with guns, they call me El Pozolero, the stew maker. But I don't make stew. I don't even eat stew. You just dissolve bodies and barrels of lye. Great. I bury them too. Sometimes. Why are you looking at me like that? It's not like I kill people pepito would never let me do that why wouldn't he because it's not part of my job of course are you sure we can go back for pepito i'm sure don't worry we'll let him know there weren't any giraffes or any other animals gracias no doubt he'll still pout about being left behind but if you say can we help then <laughs> Inigo Morales, district court judge, disappeared on his way home from work. Octavio Rodriguez, student activist, kidnapped by a gang of armed men outside a local bar, never seen again. That sucks. Mirabel Castro, school teacher, last seen at an Unidad checkpoint in Santa Cruz. That sucks. I remember her. She had beautiful skin, like an angel. There's a thousand more like them in this stack, you son of a bitch, and that's just this year. Every one of them had a family. People out of their minds with grief because their loved ones are gone. But they were dead. What else could I do? Midas thinks he's got the mind of a child. Probably has no idea what you're talking about. Well, he better have a fucking photographic memory. I want the names of every single person you put in one of those drums. I don't care how long it takes. Do you understand me? Yes. Okay. Then you will take me back, verdad? handle stupid and I can handle grim talking sure in ghost recon needs to be more Hollywood exactly. military chatter like Call of Duty and less what this is like his brain broke does that speak to the quality of average yeah. third-person right, game the what are you referring to there do you think some sequels with games fail because they're trying too hard to be innovative take away from the things people played from the first game happening with some games yo Bill metal what up bro I think I think obviously at a certain point a company has to understand when they've kind of squeezed every ounce of juice you know out of what they're what they're doing for instance when Ubisoft went open world with Wildlands I think they had at least another game of two with this type of continuation to go from this to breakpoint you know, like switch, like tiered loot raids with robots, and you know they had a lot of weird decisions and breakpoint that didn't make any sense when they could have just honed in on what they had here and just try to make it better. As far as you know, other IPs, you know, look at games like Uncharted, bro. All of them do well, but then I think what like Just Cause by like the fourth one where people tired of it did it was it not as good then you have to remember also yo developers you figure what do you have a 20 30 year career so the people who made your first splinter cell your first ghost recon like yo they're gone they might be in management positions or they might be on another team with other people or they might be retired so you're left with a, a studio that's like oh red storm made this they made this it's gonna be good like yo it's not the same red storm like those people are gone it's not the same uh ubisoft uh you know people building splinter cell and unreal back in 2000s you know and then dropping it you know it's like so 
you know, there's a there's a I think a bunch of things that lead to a franchise kind of dwindling. I think we all want another SOCOM, everyone except Jay. Matt playing The Last of Us multiple times because Thirty Kings are typically not great. See, yo, Jay, so like it's funny you say that because I disagree. I think third person games are some of the best games on the market. Like across ac across the spectrum of type of third person games, whether you're playing your Dragon's Dogma, your Sakaio dies twice, you know your Elden Ring, your Ghost Recon's, your Uncharted's, your Tomb Raiders, like your Final Fantasies, your like whether whether your freaking World of Warcrafts, like whatever it may be, you know you don't you don't think that. You think all third person are bad or just like third person shooters? Love Uncharted. Yo, John, what up, bro? Yeah, I mean, I I bought my PS4 with the Uncharted the Uncharted package, right? And I played through all three of them back to back to back. And then my my friend had four, and I borrowed four. And like, yo, I love Uncharted. I think is a great series. And. Never played SOCOM? Oof, man, you missed out. God of War? Yeah, like God of War. SOCOM did third person to me. SOCOM is one of the reasons why I I got so... I felt like so in love with third person because they I felt like they did the third person control so good. The creep, the crouching around, the proning, the shooting, everything felt really good in, in third person. And then you could zoom in Right, and it had that old school, uh, like um, Ghost Recon feel to it for a lot of the people who were playing Ghost Recon on like PC or whatnot. Spider Man, yeah, I mean, like all, like right, they're all third person games. I don't know. I think I wouldn't call. I wouldn't call. I wouldn't call third person games typically not great, uh, especially since when was the last first person game? The last first person game that won like a game of the year, even though I know you, you probably think that doesn't matter, and I would agree with you to a certain extent, was what? Overwatch? And that was typically just because like Overwatch kind of birthed that new type of uh PvP. But um <clears throat> I mean shit, what do we do now? Go into Tabakal. A respected Cocolero named Chavez is trying to Third person games that follow a single character, the majority of them seem to be very similar and have poor control. Well, yo, Jay, honestly, that's one of the that's one of the reasons why I love great third person games because I think it's very hard to make them. So when they're made well and the controls feel good and your character actually feels grounded in the game world, it's like, yo, that's what really like checks all the boxes for me. It's like, oh shit, this is really good. Because there are a lot of games where, you know, the character might feel too floaty or just like the movement, you know, the movement of the camera compared to the animation cycle. Just it's just it's off. It just doesn't feel like you're 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 landing on the in the game world when that when it actually feels grounded. And I think that's that's when you could if the gameplay is good, then it's like, yo, this is a, this is a really good game. Whoa, right in front of me, almost killed me. Changing weapons was amazing in third person. There's definitely nothing wrong with being creative, but some design decisions are to be desired with uh, some sequels. I love my point of view. Porn games, best first person games there are. <laughs> okay. Napoleon, let us know how you really feel, bro. Let us know how you really feel, my man. I was like, third person games can feel great, but most of them don't. Yeah, that's why a middling game can be replayed by some people if they don't like first person games. Metal Gear Solid. Wow, you think Metal Gear Solid feels bad? Wow, I think Metal Gear Solid feels great, dude. I think the running is a little, is a little fake. Like his running, but I think that I think that's done purposely to just have him like flying through shit. But I think like I think the normal the normal movement 
and the, the crouching the going to prone I, th I think it's I think it feels great GTA feels bad GTA is the 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 movement system and physics in GTA is always kind of iffy um I thought Red Dead Red Dead was definitely probably the best so far so let's hope GTA 6 is a huge improvement oh we're back to this mission okay everyone on the ground get down Oh man, I must have come over here and grabbed this. Who the is are you? I really don't have a problem Keep with mother's control. control. People do crazy it's moves in that game. Senor. It can't be Boy, that bad. I like I like the controls. I think he feels he feels grounded. His movement feels good when you're you know the majority of the game you're you're creeping around, proning, crou you know, crouching. It's that simple. Madre Coco is going to send in her people and it's going to get bloody. So I should stay silent? That's your answer? Se equivoca. Yo, Bill, when it comes hey, to games that have no flying in them, do you think it can be difficult to make way, as far as flying controls to get the aspect right in games? You know, flying controls, some Still games bad. aren't good. Absolutely. Jay, Jay hates, the, hates the fact that all these are so, like, corny, arcadey feeling. Because he, lo he, like, loves to play games like Arma and shit. So when you look at it from that aspect, yes... They're doing they're doing what they feel the majority of the audience, you know, can just get, you know, hop in and move. They're not trying to make it too complicated. Look at Wildlands, for example. You had the old school, you had the old school helicopter. Chavez blew up our and um they changed it. The rebels say Chavez is the real deal. They ended up giving you the 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 simpler controls, which for shooting I could understand why they did that. Cause shooting was really hard with the old controls. Yo, Stiggy Wiggy, yeah, Wildlands, Wildlands definitely pops a bit more, bro. Definitely has a good pop to it. Each biome has its own own specific look. Maybe we should keep the guns down. Make sure we don't scare anybody. Well, I think they should pick up a gun and fight, in my opinion. Shit. They all they want to unionize, but they don't want to pick up weapons and fight for what they need. <sighs> Not even the arcade GTA's aircraft are very arcadey, but feel great. I could understand from that aspect. Like, uh, yeah, definitely Ubisoft's, uh, like, Ghost Recon definitely doesn't have the, the greatest, uh, controls for, like, airplanes and shit, really. It feels really bad. So that definitely I understand. If you're con comparing, like, GTA's plane to Ghost Recon's plane, <laughs> where the hell are these bad guys at? There we go. Ready? Everyone on the ground, get down. We rattled somebody's cage. Dropped him. I'm engaging takeoffs. Good shooting. Let's clean up and move on. I'm saying that first person crazy control is much higher. What do you mean? I mean by higher, like tighter. Oh my God, bro. Look how many dudes spawned back here. Damn. That's it. We're clear. 
Are we? Because there's another car coming, bro. Looks like the pillar broke. We're clear on this side. Yo, you hide him, bro? Chavez is secure. Good work. Keep digging for intel on Madre Coca's operations. We need to know where the Coca leads are going and where they're being stored prior to transit. Roger that. We're on it. Oh, there's one more car coming in? I'm good. Crank it. Oh, no, it's a lieutenant. Rebels in Santa Blanca are throwing light. Poke the hornet's nest. Firing. Uh. Madre Coca's and forces arrive every night to cook. I'm out of control. Yeah, I mean, a bad third-person game is a bad third-person game. Because I think they try to they try to make a lot more inertia and things like that. So if it doesn't work, it's like, eh. I mean, a bad first-person game, what it just is going to feel like really arcadey, but... It's still going to be generic movements, right? It's just like forward, back, side to side. Peripheral vision in first person have never been perfected. First person is unrealistic. Yo, you know what would be fucking awesome, dude? Yo, imagine... You know how, you know how people set up... Yo, you know how people set up for like Gran Turismo? They set up games where like they have a monitor here and then they have monitors to the side. Yo, that would be dope to play like a first person game like that where you have monitors that surround you. And you could just, yo, you could be playing and you could just be like this, like normally. Like you don't have to actually turn your character in game to see the entire game world. Basically, a, a you know, like a step where that's basically a step before we get into virtual reality. But imagine being able to a game being able to render that. That should be sick, bro. Their person barely has any extra vision. I think it's more it's more of like a, it's it's not that you don't have extra vision. It's just that you feel you have a little bit more peripheral vision because since the camera's back you can you can kind of you you kind of feel like okay i could see my flanks but you know they're expensive when you want a high refresh rate i mean and then of course you're gonna need like what double 40 90s to render the entire like that's just wild bro Looks like the cocaleros are putting together a big shipment to hand over to the cartel gun up and wait but that shit would be fun to set up. Like, yo, bro, if I was like, if I was like a huge YouTuber, bro, like that would be, that would be crazy to set up. Cause people, they set up all these things for like racing games, but I've never seen anybody set that up for a, uh, like a shooter. But I don't know if it's, I don't know. I think the game might have to be, I don't know. Does the game have to be created for that or? Like, yo, that, that shit's crazy. I don't know. That shit would be awesome, though. We're done here. The cartel won't get any coca from these guys anymore. Nice. Now we exfil and wait for the fallout. Those guys did not think a chopper with freaking armed assassins were going to float over their base and just absolutely destroy them. Ready? Keep fire, 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 fire. Roger.
Uh, yo, the hand. Yo, thanks for stopping by and fucking hanging out for a bit, brother. Enjoy the rest of your evening, dude. Kill confirmed. I think it was like, uh, Where? having a nurse or cat moving in third person is good. Yeah, yo, and yo, Breakpoint did it really well before they nerfed it. And like in OTT and in the beta, they st the character had a lot of inertia and they nerfed the shit out of it, bro. I think it's like 24 9 something. Most new games, some old games can run ultra wide. Yeah, but imagine all the way around. That should be crazy, bro. Want an ultra wide curved monitor? Maybe I might do that. Sniper, top of the tower. Fuckers on the tango. I'm opening fire on these ships. Copy. Tango down. They're out here trying to run. Got a break. Those assholes are going the wrong way. I'd like, I'd like, probably maybe the next time I uh, upgrade my uh, computer. You guys ready? Fire. Roger. Maybe I'll get like a nice ultra wide, but yeah, they're expensive, right? It's highly exaggerated, has magnetic cover, he stands up without you telling him to exaggerate. Oh, yeah, Jay, you know, uh, yeah, you know what it is, Napoleon? I see, I see when you're saying, when you're saying like that, Jay, when you get specific like that, like, I'm really just talking about how he feels when you move him. Like, I feel like he feels grounded in the game world. Yeah, you know what it is, Napoleon? Jay doesn't like it when the game does too much for you, so he doesn't... Jay wants to hit a button and aim himself. You know what I'm saying? He wants to, he doesn't want the game, he doesn't want to go up against cover. And when you hold the aim button, he automatically pops up. You know what I'm saying? Like shit like that. We, like we've spoken about that before. Uh, yeah. Jorge, the Navy Seals are going to be sent to Mexico for training. Sprinting is off as if they think you can only sprint in a straight line. I say track field isn't a thing. Yeah, the sprinting is a little like exaggerated in, in Metal Gear. Who died when he was about Jorge's age. She offered Jorge a job. Jorge's father protested. So, she had the old man stuffed in the stack of tires and set him on fire. Jorge has been her adopted son and right hand man ever since. That's seriously fucked up. Salazar's probably the one person in the world Madrakoka really trusts. We grab him. It'll turn her world upside down. We'll see what we can do. Coming up on the target. Damn. We could run a hell of a lot of freight through a rail yard like that. It used to be coffee beans for a Yapa cafe back in the day. Now it's all coca all the time. All right, it's you know what? Let's go. Stocks. Focus on the warehouses and the main building. Let's go, boys. Fine, get in them. there. Copy that. Let's get it done. Get in there, boys. Let's do the dirty. Come on, guys. You can't stay back there. Let's go. Yeah, these dudes are getting murked. Damn, I really wanted like a them to run in a lot while I provided air cover. Eyes out. Got Sicarios guarding the freight yard. Let's ride. Ready? Open fire. We'll go.
Let's go, rebels. Get in there. Ooh, another one? Not another one, right? No. Oh my god, look at that. What a fucking idiot I am. Thought he was dead. I'm asking the rebels to draw their attention. I got the C4 Prime. Magnetic cover, Shmo doesn't really get in my way. Yeah, but that's because you like, if you don't mind it, it's you know. I think the I think him going against the cover is is fine. I like it. I I I don't need a snap to cover when it's intuitive like that. But I could understand maybe if there was a way to turn off, you know, automatically popping up to aim and and things like that. But then you would need some way to kind of like pop out of cover other than using crouch to stand up. You need a side to side pop out of cover as well. I also, uh, will Ghost Project Over be set in the future past? Yo, so Hughes, um, as we know now, there's no actual, like, date, so we really don't know. Rebels in Santa Blanca are throwing lead. We want to get some? Frag out. Ghost got destroyed. So we just, yo, um, Hughes, we just have to wait and see to when Ubisoft actually announces the game, because all we know now is what Tom Henderson told us about it. Clear over here. Frag out. Come in here to Culeros. What? Yeah, we own this shit now, boys. Oh, a llama. Oh, there we go. Yeah, die. Die, llama, die. Oh, bro, I thought that was a bad guy. The way he was moving, he was so... He moved with such authority. I was like, for sure this isn't a rebel. This is definitely Santa Blanca. Oh my god, did this guy get- He got run over by a train, bro. He got run over by a train. Oh my god. What a loser. Where is he? Oh, he's over there. Get up, bro. I don't know if that works on them. I don't remember. Good eyes of the coca stock here. Nice. Madre Coca's fallen. One Coca stash at a time. I asked the rebels to send over a field of force. Uh, I've never played Aliens Dark Descent, Dark. Yo, Dark, did you just hop? Yo. Yo, Dark, how long did I say what's up to you, Dark? Or did you just hop in here? 
Yeah, you just hopped in here, right? You should play Aliens Dark Descent. It's really fun and hard, plus it's tactical, lol. <laughs> so, I've never played that. I also greatly prefer avatar based controls. I want to know with 100% certainty that I will move in the direction I'm intending to move. The cover is the worst I've ever felt. I finished Breakpoint, completed a few times, and done all the episodes and Motherland. It had potential to be a really good game when playing the map. It just feels dead. Wildlands felt better. Yeah. Yeah. It's almost like Ubisoft gets halfway there and then they, that's what they release. <laughs> you know? It's like, it, it, yeah. Could have been. It could have been a lot better. I think Breakpoint's gameplay would have been better suited to fighting caves full of monsters and demons. <laughs> Most players agree on that uh, with what Hugh said. Must have been Weaver. Yeah, of course it was Weaver, bro. Of course it was Weaver who got run over by the train. <laughs> One train wiped out all my AI teammates. Sheesh. Imagine you're in ghost mode and that happens and then you're left there by yourself. Idiot getting himself run over by a train to wonder who was killed in Breakpoint Hughes. Exactly. If if a train can creep up on him, obviously it was it was easy for Walker to. That wasn't difficult. Madrid Coca's right hand man is a local by the name of Salazar. She depends on him for everything. Let's see how she reacts when we take him into custody. Damn, this dude's right here. It's almost too easy. terrible all you have to do is ambush simple fucking ambush opening fire I think they took out I think they took out they took out them thank God the rebels helped as well instead of human skeletons drones imps behemoth minotaurs they even had tiered loot of diablo hey i mean they named the thing behemoth jay why not just replace it with a uh like you said a minotaur or something yo ton what up bro not sure it's not long but here for a while yo dude what's up man how you been brother we're just uh continuing on with our ghost mode gameplay uh playthrough and we are yo ton we're getting far bro we're getting far coming up at the rally point heads up this is our stop I know since you got that Mario I team, no death. <laughs> I had a lot of deaths with it, bro. I had a lot of deaths with it. You. Ubisoft could be watching, stealing Jay's ideas. That's probably what they're doing right now. Thanks to Jay, the next game is going to have, you know, demons and goblins and ghouls. <sighs> Getting closer. Madre Coca. Getting closer to Madre Coca. Oh, that's it. I think this is it right here. Just uploaded some names for us. Looks like Salazar <clears> finally <throat> caught. It's a list of Santa Blanca snitches working inside. Yeah. The <laughs> They'll steal those, do. Jay, but they Take won't steal out. those. Tactical ideas? No. Next ghost game might be a crosshair only edition. Jay's favorite. Oh, this one. Okay, Salazar this is good. Given up the names of several Cocaleros who've been secretly spying for Madre Coca. If Chavez and the others are going to stand a chance against the cartel, we need to take these fuckers. Mrs. Bowman, we got her. Holy shit, we got her. Say again? I just heard from my rebel contact in Havacal. Madre Coca's reached out to them. She thinks they're the ones who got Salazar, and she wants him back. She wants to set up a meet to negotiate. I believe she wants Salazar. The rest doesn't matter. We've got Madra Coca right where we want her. You can accompany the rebels to the meet. Talk to her. 
convinced her that if she wants Salazar back, she's got to play along. I'm sending coordinates for the RV now. The Rebels will take you to the meet. I'm counting on you to keep things from getting out of hand, Nomad. We need Madricoca alive. <laughs> What a quinky dink. Bowman, we're coming up on the RV now. Good. The rebels are waiting. Follow them and they'll lead you to Madricoca. Here's those janky soldiers. That's right. <laughs> Follow us. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Jay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Mark Hughes, what idiot would want that? <coughs> Jay. <laughs> Come on, bro. Follow. Let's go. How are we going to handle the meat, boss? What's the move? I'll do the talk. Go. Go. See how she reacts. Everybody else hold back. I don't like it. If she makes a play, you'd be cut off. We'd never get to you in time. Jesus, hold it. Sound like my mother. You take your mother to a lot of hostage negotiations, boss? Look, Madre Coca's got no more reason to trust us than we do her. Come on, dude, let's go. I roll up on her with the whole team and can sour the deal. So we play this one straight until we know different. Understood? Whatever you say, boss. You know I got your back. Hell yeah, that's what I'm counting on. Just gonna come over here and kill her myself. Good eyes on Madre Coca. Here we go. Ambush! Hold on. Boom, and this is no matter. What the hell happened? It was an ambush. Madre Coca never <laughs> Yo, imagine a freaking chopper just flies down and blasts your Madre Coca Buchon right in the fucking fat face and then takes off. Mission checkpoint, kill Madre Coca. Uh, no. <laughs> Madre Coca is dead. Mission checkpoint. Ambush, light these assholes up. Kill supporters, don't really need to. Madre Coca is done. Yeah. Wasn't surprised there were oh, <laughs> sex robots in a row. <laughs> there probably were. <laughs> they were just hidden. <laughs> oh man. Oh man, oh man. I don't think I need I'm gonna I'm just I don't think I need Media Luna to be honest. Nomad just tells Bowman Madre Coca caught a stray bullet afterwards. Caught a stray bullet from my uh, Gatling gun. All right, I guess. Um, what do we do now? Quite a few stray bullets. <clears throat> Could try Media Luna and die. We're getting so close. It's like these have to open up. Like, where is. Oh, he's already. Oh, he's already there. Okay. Let's go grab him. Go grab him. We've got intel on a convoy of trucks loaded with cash. Let's go grab him. Then we could grab the Beauty Queen. We got to get La Gringa. We gotta get the cardinal. Save that for after you. <laughs> Jay's like, yo, G. Just try to just try to kill Swenyo, bro. Don't do this all again. <laughs> yo, Gabrag, what up? Madre Coca is completed. Not completed. Completed? Not completed. What do we know? The damage you've done to cartel production. Oh, look, Lagringa. She's talking about. Sueño's discovered that La Gringa's been cutting the purity of her cocaine, and he sent his people to kill her. Get to La Gringa and bring her in. She's got nowhere else to go. 
I mean, I'm already here, bro. Let me just see if I can grab this. Trucks loaded with cash heading to cartel bosses in Mexico. El Boquita is believed to be leading the convoy. Intercept the trucks and destroy them, and if possible, take out Boquita as well. Oh my god. I don't know where this is at. I just know I don't want to get blown out of the freaking sky. Mr. NYC himself, Mr. New York in the house. What's up, brother? Here's the informant. Hear what he's got to say. What's the deal, bro? What you up to? How's your, uh, how's your beautiful Wednesday going? Time to smash la gringa. I mean, the mission, of course. Of course, of course, of course. Okay, it's like this. G must be tired, missing some chats. I'm missing chats? Oh man, yeah. My bad. I'm doing my best, bro. I'm doing my best. I don't know. know the route. That's not good. Yo, Hughes, exactly, dude. It's pretty vital that the next Ghost Recon does well. Could end up just like Splinter Cell. You don't see it for another decade. Meanwhile, yo, dude, if you think about it, we're already halfway there. The last Splinter Cell we got was 2012, right? So it's 12 years ago. But the last Ghost Recon we got was, tw was 2019. So it's already five years. So we're like halfway there. We're, we're halfway there to not seeing a Ghost Recon as long as we didn't see a uh, Splinter Cell. All right, let's find out the Not a gunshot till we have the money in sight. All right, let's not get shot out of the sky. Hopefully. Punch it, man. Oh, I I know there's one in that base. and El Boquita. We'll tail him to the money. Roger that. We've got a tap on his cell phone. If he makes a call, says anything about the money or the convoy's route, you'll be able to listen in. Oh, shit. Yo, Jay. Yo, Jay, you scared me there for a minute because you, when you said I want to watch the mission, I was like, oh, my God, don't tell me I have... I thought I had the chat screen up, bro. I was like, no, don't tell me I did that. But a ring around Koka's head is not completed. Why do I hear La Gringa briefing? Because that's how La Gringa just pops up. She doesn't have her own province or anything. Like, she just pops up. Wasn't I told that uh, Splinter Cell Blacklist did well? That trash game? I gotta be honest, I don't think... I think all the Splinter Cells decline. Even, even Chaos Theory did worse than like the first one, I think. Not as good as you be wanted, yeah. Shit, brother, everything is good. Money staying sucker free in a world full of suckers, baby. You know it. Just got home from work, showing some love to my guy, snacking on these well <laughs> Yo, salute, bro. Hell yeah, dude. Shout out to you. 
Shout out to Welch's Fruit Snacks. I need to get me some more of those so I can uh, get sponsored and, uh, you know, make some moolah. Oh, man. Yeah, dude. Work, baby. Always got to... Always got to be in the office, make that money, brother. Especially, psh, yo, man. The city is freaking basically unlivable, bro. Yo, cinematic tactics. What's up, run? Do I have an office job? I work for a living, brother. <laughs> That's how it's done. She came out of nowhere. Brrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
Where's that at? Where's that car? Where's that car at? All right, I'm good. I'm good. Call Pakatari for some reinforcements. And they got a lockdown already. Nice. Let's go. Who are you? What do you want? We're your way out of this mess. Understand? But we've got to move right fucking now. I won't get far. Not like this. I know someone. He lives in a village not far from here. The rebels, they take their wounded to him when they can. Yeah, it would be a big job, man. Obviously, there's something. The way that game was made, they can't port it. Uh, and they, I think Ubisoft Shanghai or someone made that shit. And they probably don't have the source or, or something to where it's like they just can't they just can't do it. A few years and a few tons of coke later, he introduces you to the rebels. He needed medicine and vaccine. I had the money. I don't get you. What do you get out of playing both sides? Hell if I know. I came to Bolivia to help people. Oh, look at Lagringa hopping fences and shit. Yeah, let's go. I see what's happening here. I'm starting to feel cold. Why would Pakatari protect a cartel scientist like you? Uh, I, I've been using Swainio's money to. I can't. Please. I've got to stop. Don't quit on me now, lady. Sight's just up ahead. Who are you? What do you want? You know this woman? What happened? Believe me, Doc, it's better if you don't know. She's got a GSW to the shoulder. Can you help her? Si, por supuesto. Leave her with me. I'll do everything I can. We'll buy you all the time we can, but you need to work fast. I've got a feeling Sueño's not done with her yet. Put a call to the rebels for some reinforcements. I'm riding the motorcycle. Contact. Sueño sent another crew after us. Take him down. Chopper inbound. Rebels in Santa Blanca are throwing lead. Want to get some? Chopper, down, down. Engaging takeoffs. Got the helo. Shit. He shouldn't have been standing there. I asked the rebels to do a recon of the area. Sending our intel on enemy positions. Absolute carnage. We all in one piece? Nice. Absolute carnage. Is there a talking remake or just a rumor? Are we talking, what are we talking about here? Uh... Remix not so not so confined. Remasters usually used for the purpose of updating graphics. Yeah. Yo, G, are we going to get some hell diver streams after you finish Wildlands? Just really got into the game. It's pretty cool. Absolutely, Lucko. I think maybe we'll take a break. We'll do a couple hell diver streams and we'll reassess where, where where we want to move from there. And then maybe we'll move into like a breakpoint stream with all the updated mods and uh, Spartan realism and all that. You know, maybe we'll do something like that. Official uh, splits of remake PT and CT are wild rumors. That's interesting. Word, boss? We've given the doc all the time we can. One way or another, we're getting La Gringa out of here. Okay, Gringa, time to go. Please, just 
We don't have a minute. Get your lazy ass up. The cocktail the doctors it's only a GSW to the shoulder. Let alone that bullet. We're leaving. You feel like you're gonna keel over a puke? Just look at the horizon. It'll keep you steady. I can see clearly now. La gringa's gone. Time to get the bu 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 beauty queen. We're at the extraction point. Let's get her to Bowman and call for a dust off. Without the cartel making those drugs up. Oh yeah. I don't know why, but I just noted no, that they took the AI teammates shooting it's from helicopters and wildlands, but I didn't add the same feature in Breakpoint. Wait, wait, wait. Here. Open it. Mm. You know, I never realized that. I would have, I would have to, I would have to, um, yeah, when I play Breakpoint again, I gotta see, like, the AI teammates, they don't, you gotta assume that they, they rushed the AI teammates out because they weren't, they weren't gonna use them. So they they probably copy and pasted a lot of what was working over whatever they could and just tried you know connecting everything and by the time they were done and shipped it a lot of shit didn't work i don't know i don't know i got i would have to i would have to see all right la gringas nice all right let's grab the beauty queen Where's that at? Missions. We've caused so oh, much we damage to Nydia Flores's network that El Sueño decided he's better off without her. Extract Flores and her daughter before the Sicarios get to them. You got it. Yo, actually, Jay, think about it. Think about it, Jay. Yo. It makes no sense to say GSW, right? G S double, right? G S W. G S W. Gunshot wound. Gunshot wound. GSW. Gunshot wound. <laughs> it makes no sense. It's it's way right. It's like yo, just say yo, nomad. Just say gunshot wound, bro. You're not saving anybody any time, bro. <laughs> yo, it's crazy, Jay. It's crazy. They, they they try to sound all tactical, Jay, but it didn't make any sense. Alpha. In Breakpoint, the teammates only shoot from ground vehicles, but not aerial vehicles. Oh shit, Mr. New York. I never never realized that, bro. And probably you know why, because in Breakpoint, there's just like there's a lot of choppers, I guess, but I feel like there's a lot more. There's a lot more type of those firefights in this game with unidad and all these choppers yeah but i gotta i gotta reassess that man if the choppers didn't get destroyed so fast you know you'd probably recognize it you'd feel it more yo jay that's one thing i'm trying to jay that's one thing i want to get the modders to fix but I don't think they can because I I just think it's it's constant damage. I don't think the actual You know what? No, probably. Jay, if there's a way that we could figure out, like in breakpoint, if they could find the value of health for choppers and like times it by ten. I think that would that would add uh a, a little bit more. Must have got bit by something. That would add a, a, a little more realism for you. Keegan, I'm laying off tacos for a while. They said VHC instead of vehicles in Mars. And uh, I don't know why, bro. Got it. Reinforcements will be flying in anytime soon. 
But I know I know there's another one. Until so it's paying attention to your gameplay. Oh shit, interesting. Pretty sure there's one more. Hey, we're good. Oh shit. I Man. think that's all of them. Man, this rain is crazy. Watch for civilians. We don't want to kill somebody by mistake. Clear. How are you guys holding up? Rain is wild, bro. That was a freaking scout, bro. Don't tell me. I know my job. I know a scout when I see one. That guy's just walking back and forth. Sure. Sure. Out in the rain. Up here in high ground. I know a scout when I see one. Yeah, talking about shooting helos. Yeah. Like, like if we could get the modders to find the health value of the helo and like, and like up it this way, when you're shooting at them, it's kind of like you're there forever wasting all your ammo. So you kind of want to take out, but then you see, that's where, that's where it gets difficult, right? Because then if you up, if you up the health of the chopper and you shoot a rocket at it, it probably won't get blown out of the sky. So you would have to literally hard code it, which they're not going to be able to do. To be susceptible, whoops, my bad. To be susceptible to rockets and not to bullets. So either way, it's a double-edged sword. I just want you guys to recognize that there is no sniper up here. There are stairs though. So I will give the benefit of the doubt that they can kind of pop up. But there's literally no one anywhere. Oh shit. So that dude knows what's up. That dude knows what's up. It's freaking weather, bro. Sheesh. Weather is out of control. Oh shit, are those? Oh, okay. Shit. Swingos people are hitting the hacienda now. Oh Smooth. shit, word. I called for rebels to draw their attention. Helicopter incoming. Ready? Fire, fire, fire. Damn it. See, I told you there was one more. Shit, we got a sniper. Where? Is that guy in a Helicopter, get down. I got the fucking 
Let's go, Rebels. I need you in there like yesterday. Damn, fucking Holt is that booking it. Set, ready to assault. Fire. Roger. What the hell? What the hell? Jeez, thanks a lot, guys. Oh my god. Yo. I'm not letting you guys off the leash ever again. Open fire. Okay, I'll just leave you and uh let this guy just um shoot shoot at you. Okay, close this. No more of that. There we go. All right, go. <laughs> Jeez, man. Go. Move there. We'll go. Go. Roger. I'll take this beautifully, conveniently placed ammo. Thank you very much. Move there. Roger. Go. Copy. Hell yeah, rebels are coming in. Rebels are coming in. I got eyes on Nidia. Here they come. No, you really don't, bro. They're upstairs. You don't have eyes on them. I guess they couldn't figure out a uh, height in their code. I need you there. Copy that. Target's marked. Just say the word. All right, let's find a, a st stairs. All right, we came from there. Where are the stairs? Are the stairs outside? Nah, it's gotta be stairs. It's gotta be stairs inside, right? It's gotta be stairs inside. Rally up, people. Roger that. Okay, we're still good. All right, let's check outside. I guess. I guess these are the only stairs to get up. Shut up. Bro, I'm literally yoking you up. What are you going to do? What could you... Oh, shit. Let me see if I could start this. Actually, let me see if I do this. What happens? Shit. Let me see if I start this, if it blows up. Try to take us off some sweet jumps, all right? All right. Hot damn! Uh, what's going on here? Guys, whatever that is, shoot him. Oh, shit. What the hell? Ah, oh, shit. Can I? St oh, I could stow her in here. Oh, that's awesome. Get in there. I was about to say that's going to suck. The beauty queen is captured. You people are gonna fuck me over the first chance you oh, get. Oh, oh. <laughs> Definitely gonna fuck you 
over the first chance I get. Your life was a permanent fast Most definitely. We didn't make Swingo send people to kill you. He saved you and your daughter. Right. After you destroyed all of it. My life's work. Everything I had. Well, not everything. El jefe is a very big hombre, like uh, a monster truck. I heard he's very tall. You don't like El jefe. I, I don't like him either. Mija. Damn, look at that rendering on the street. What the hell? I don't like because he tried to hurt you and your mama? No, I don't like him because he has no hair. Now there's nothing wrong with <gasps> not having hair. Coming up on the RP. Oh, Karenya. I'm so offended right now. Whatever happens, just remember that mama loves you. Okay, mama. Compass. Getting media. I'm not going to talk. Yo, Jay, thanks, bro. In the back on the pilot side. <laughs> I want you to listen. I want to tell you and story. over and over <laughs> from the corrections Wonder made added content after the game originally came out breakpoint probably would have had a better launch if they just took their time uh, the first time uh, with their resources lessons learned right Nydia loved El Sueño. he was like the father she never had and all Nydia ever wanted was to make him proud of her Nydia was so afraid hey G are you yo Eagle what up that she even sacrificed. G is that I, I I'm actually black. Yes. Can't you tell? The father of her child. Yes, Eagle. I'm also a mutt. And I got some Espanol in my blood. Wasn't enough. Your sis <laughs> your, your opinions don't matter. True. <laughs> you know nothing. I know one thing. I know that once I sign this, you will be extradited to the United States and you will never, ever see that little girl again that's she true you know that's true jay there you go she won't even remember who you are okay so jay you just figured it out i'm gonna i'm gonna talk to some modders bro i'm gonna see if we could have rockets do x amount of damage and see if we could find aircraft aircraft damage uh aircraft health up it all the way and then have rockets be equivalent to that this way, when you shoot the choppers, they don't just fly out the sky. You actually need, you know, a rocket or something. That'd be kind of good. It's kind of good. Oh, yeah. Oh, baby. So we are there. We are there. Um, so I might as well just do that. It's larger scopes, which I don't really do. Enemy vehicles. That's good. What don't I have? Oh my god, really? Damn, that's whack. Weapon. You know, I need some items. I could use more. I guess more C4. Flashbangs, why not? Physical, no pain. After being revived, that's good. Okay. Oh, detection. I should really have this. Aircraft shield, which is good. Quiet running. Harder for enemies to detect. There we go. Now we're... Now we're looking, uh... Oh, born leader, baby. AI teammates. Damn, look at this. I haven't... I've been playing with them not even as efficient killers. Because I'm supposed to be playing with A squad most of the time. Squad resilience. More resilient. Resilient to bullet damage. Nice. I don't use sync shots really that much. Whatever. Revive speed. This, this is what I need. All right. Nice. All right. Yo, we're, we are... We are killing it right now. I mean, hot damn, we're killing it. Senior rebel leader named Amaru has been captured. <laughs> Let's do Itaqua. The very first land that <laughs> should be done. If they're doing that, they might as well increase the damage output of helos and miniguns make vehicles terrifying. It's all it's all about what they can find, really. But um I you know I have been in communication with someone and they're they're looking into trying to do certain things with damage and so but they, you know, you have to actually find, if you could find the helo or the helicopters and everything. Hear this. The activity found a message for you on one of Santa Blanca's websites. 
A message for us. There aren't any other four Americans causing trouble for Sueño. He says he wants to talk. He's acting like he'll negotiate, sing Kumbaya and hug it out. The meeting's bait, but it could also be a chance to draw Sueño out. Sure. It's also a chance to get yourself killed. There's nothing to stop this from becoming a two-way shooting gallery. Send us the info. If you want to throw lead, we can throw lead. I don't think you understand. This is a bad idea. Bowman. <laughs> a squad abandoned us. We'll decide. Fine. Do what you want. Bowman out. A <laughs> squad saved. She's like, I'm not logging in. <laughs> Yeah, bro, you talk. <laughs> Yo, because Lucko, remember, we died so many times that when we started the last playthrough, I skipped all the beginning ones that we were doing over and over because then we kept freaking dying out here somewhere. So I was like, you know what? We're just going to do everything else first. But now I don't even think it's going to matter. Where is that mission at? El Sueño wants to meet. Maybe he wants to negotiate. Maybe he wants to kill you. Either way, watch your ass. <laughs> okay, we're getting there, boys. Oh my god, we're getting, we're getting there. We're getting there. <clears throat> Imagine dying in it. <laughs> Imagine I died in Itaqua, bro. Holy shit. I think I would I would uninstall the game and I would I would do ghost mode another time. I'd be like, alright, we gotta take a break from ghost mode. It's absolutely destroying me. Taking us down a level. We thought we thought we were here, but we're really here. So we got to see what's up. We're gonna have to play freaking Hello Kitty Adventure. Go play some Pal World. Oh yeah? Is that how it works? Fuck's sake. I still don't see anybody. Fuck is going on? Stay sharp. Watch for an ambush. Hola, caballeros. This is El Sueño. It is a pleasure to finally speak with you. And here I thought we were gonna meet face to face. Don't tell me you're running late. I apologize for the subterfuge. But people in our line of work, we must be cautious. But I am not a liar. There are no Sicarios in your area. No unidad. I only wish to talk. Tell us where you are, then we'll talk. I am only attempting to end the bloodshed. There is no need for it. How are they making money though, bro? And it is bad for Bolivia. This country has been trying to get back on its feet for decades. Do not kick it back down. Says the guy who turned this country into his own personal glory hole. How are they making money with that? Like, there are four cars in front of you. I don't even get it. Unless they're unless they're building something in Roblox engine and then just launching it on Steam, Fortnite is. I, I you know, you you can't do that in Fortnite, right? You have to literally just go into Unreal. I thought you were gonna tier mode it. Oh, I think I have to activate tier mode. Ah, uh, yo, bro, I just want to. I'm just gonna be ghost mode. Sorry. the scammer. See, we only came to this oh, like, um, do tier mode after I kill Sueño? I mean, yeah, we could until we die. We're good. We'll die eventually in tier mode. You know that, right? Like, tier mode is just, is wild. Sueño has the only thing. It must be you could sell it or Epic is buying it. It probably has to be really good, bro. Jay, you probably have to be extremely good with Unreal Engine. And they're, they're basically just building shit and, and importing it. Sueño made us a pretty lucrative job offer. Job offer. Benefits package wasn't great. We told him we were gonna kill him. So you're stuck with us for now. Fair enough. Be in touch. I'm on. El Sueño's offer declined. A 
Okay, so... Tier mode is just grinding old missions over and over. You'll be put in place to make people buy boosters. Yeah. Oh, I'm aware. <laughs> yeah. It, it was to give you something to do in the game. To keep you in the game world, but to give you, uh, you know, rewards. So. But it also, you know, shit gets harder, dude. Pilot. Oh well, we're over here. Might as well just do this. Operating a coca paste lab inside a converted fish processing plant in Okoro. Find the lab and shut it down. Oh shit. Move there and shoot that guy if he comes outside. Call the rebels with some indirect fire. In position, targets marked. Just say the word. Drifting too far apart. Bad guys are reacting to the blast. Come on, hop on, hop on, hop on. Get on. There you go. Sniper up in the tower. We're clear. Poof. Caught that third guy, bro. Yeah, yo, I, I mean, I sold out once, but I don't know, Lucko. Maybe I could sell out again and just uh, cash that ticket. Cha-ching! Hostiles in the area. Stay frosty. Yo, cartel gunman. Right by Ooh, the Oh, man, I want to try to catch that dude's head so bad. <laughs> oh man what is this guy doing all right we're good. the alarms rigged up I shut the damn alarm off all right let's see if I could grab the oh it's too here. far I can't see it beautiful good job video game can't render can't render a good snipe shot. Cranberry traffickers. Wait, that's ocean spray. Ocean spray. I got to think of a good catchphrase so I could get ocean spray to. Uh... Oh, man, that's far. Got the tier 25, just turned on tier mode during the dailies. It's, I'll do a little convoy farming. It's tough, man. Make do like my make do like my check bounce. Yo, bro, I hope your check's not bouncing, bro. Shit. see it now oh oh we got the there we go just 
Should just kill him. Just kill them all. Let God sort them out. Ooh, this is going to be a, a wicked shot. Oh, man. Damn it. Damn, bullet drop. I called for rebels to draw their attention. I know we're here. Be careful. Oh, hell, that was a rebel. I called Pakatari for some reinforcements. There we go. Let's go, boys. Look at these guys. Look at them coming in. There we go. Let's go. Let's fuck shit up. Where the hell is that guy going? Oh, those are rebels out there? Damn. Sorry, rebels. Go. Roger. Yo, I have all these rebels behind me, bro. Let's go, rebels. Oh man, blew everything up. Jenny's over here. Oh, it's about time, baby. Good job, Weaver. It's about time you did something worthwhile. <clears throat> Go ahead, Weaver. Take him out, Weaver. Nice. Good job. Now move up. Objective. Get ready. We need to get inside and destroy the mixing packs and ovens. Man, all three of y'all. Blind as three blind mice. Three blind mice. Don't worry, guys. I got your back. You guys are absolutely useless. Let's go, gentlemen. Let's Yo, G, keep it gangsta happy, hon. Yo, Mr. New York, you probably bounced by now, but 
It's about time for your boy to go get something to eat. Check you later if you still stay sucker free, my G. Peace out to all G Money supporters in here. Yo, man. Shout out to Mr. New York. Keeping it sucker free in a world full of suckers. <laughs> Don't forget the Welch's fruit snacks, baby. Appreciate you, J Plays, and everyone else. Yo, Mr. New York. Later, brother. I like to think everyone knows. Uh, wait, 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 what? Binary choice: UB works on their fire support, or UB works on close quarter fire team tactics. Wait, wait, wait. When you say fire support, you mean like the rebels? Go. Or you mean like like what do you mean there? Absolutely murdered him, bro. <laughs> I asked the rebels to send over. Look at this guy. Wow, bro. These guys just hopped out and started blasting. Gotta love it. Clear. Stuff that you call in to do mass damage to get smoke coverage flares. Oh, okay. So like fire support missions like um So no it's mortars heal airstrikes. Uh, no mortars oh. helos airstrikes that sort of thing. Yeah, okay. I got you um Which one you would choose? Work on close quarter firearm team tactics. I mean especially after what we just saw right there <laughs> I mean yeah, I think that's the way to go. I mean, how hard is it? Yeah, I, how could they not do both? How hard is it to freaking do? Look at Hell Divers, bro. Look at Hell Divers and the amount of freaking fire support that they have. So now here's the question. Is this mission not going to pop up? scare them all off boss we ain't got enough charges to sink this bitch you got any ideas everything we need's right here all we got to do is turn on the gas coming up in the nice objective. let's get this done quick nice it's good get to know important. it's good to it's good to know what you're doing gas is running. i don't even now need to get intel i know all the intel in my brain job's done let's get the hell off this boat before it what the hell damn you guys are, you guys are Whoa, that means they just all respawned. Oh, they did all respawn. Holy shit. That's interesting. Boom, bitches. Yo, that was crazy. Imagine dying in ghost mode to some shit like that. Like, that's crazy. Hell yeah. Um. Masario's gonna have to deal with this quick, or his granddad will skin him alive. 
keep turning up the heat until he jumps. Then we get him. Bye-bye, Unidad. Ready? I got target carrying some machine guns. Roger. The lieutenant's trying to escape. Stop on the back. Stop on the door. They're onto Duck, bro. Duck while you're getting that intel. Check it out. Got a location on a cocaine factory operating out of a converted slaughterhouse here in Okoro. What are we waiting for? Let's go light this shit up. Just oh, shit! Problem. The factory door requires a key code to open it. So where do we get the code? Holy shit! What the pack. hell? Track him down. Bro, that was wild, dude. I already knew that was getting blown up. That was... Cr oh, my God. Imagine I got run over and just died. I didn't even get knocked off. Like, oh, my God, bro. That was crazy. Find the access code to the cocaine factory in a that, that, was, the that code, was so crazy, bro. Place. That would have been a hilarious. <laughs> oh my god, bro. I jumped down and <laughs> holy shit, yo, bro. That would not have been cool, dude. That would not have been cool after everything that we've done the past couple weeks. To to end it like that. Oh my god, bro. Yo, Cody, bro, almost got ghosted. Holy shit. I want to ride a horsey in Wildlands. Go play uh, Metal Gear Solid, bro. Light them up. Damn, they just abandoned you, bro. Come on, fuck. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. You've been abandoned. Heads up. I've got eyes on the assistant. Watch your I am not it's getting run star. over. Good shooting. Clean up a move Use on. me! Don't kill me! I watch oh, G oh, while I'm, I while I'm the access code showing. Wait, what? What is it? I've got two boys, two little ones. Mr. Back in the shower, G almost get it. Oh, Napoleon, dude! No, <laughs> it almost happened, bro. Pictures. Just give me the access code and we're done. Okay, Telling a horse where to go. Somebody, There's no precision. Jesus, you want to go home to Gustavo and Felipe? Just give me the damn number. I am. I swear. Okay, Jay, okay. Jay is a uh, number one number one OnlyFans uh subscriber.
Number one OnlyFans subscriber right there, bro. Oh, you said showering. I watch G while I'm showering. Okay. Yeah, I get it now, bro. Because you said you got out the shower. <laughs> That's dedication right there. Dark, that is dedication if I've ever seen it. Lather, the <laughs> Lather those toes. You want those dono bombs? Lather those toes, baby. I've been held hostage by donations. <laughs> okay, here we go. Once we're inside the factory, we take out control systems and cocaine stocks. Then we get the hell out. Get in, run around, and break shit. Oh, Copy what's that. up, bro? What you doing here? Watch your fire. We don't want to hit any civilians. Hey, we got a narco by the stack of tires. second target damn that dude was on the phone one second had no brains the next second Fucking unit, dad, bro. I'm asking the rebels to draw their attention. Let's dance. Fucking unit, dad, dude. God, don't land on me. Holy shit. Take it a shot. Bro, Okoro is mighty dangerous right now, dude. Mighty dangerous. Call the rebels for me. The drone is up. I'm calling for indirect fire. Move, move, move. No, sir. Don't get on that. Okay. Yeah. Oh, come on, bro. Oh, no. Yes.
fuck me. This place is huge. The intel said they converted an old slaughterhouse into a cocaine factory. Yeah, but I figured that was typical cartel bullshit. This, this is something else. Makes no difference to me. The bigger they are, the hotter they burn. You know what I'm saying? No. I don't know what you're saying. Care to enlighten me? Oh, we run this shit. We own this shit, boys. I might as well wait right there. Because that's where we're going to be hitting up in a second. Hell yeah, bro. Rebels are freaking taking over. We own Bolivia. Sueño doesn't know what's going on anymore. Yeah, what's up? What's up? Who wants some of this? Woo! Smoked! Rebels are not playing, bro. Hold up. There's a weapons case here. <laughs> Those mortars got me feeling MAGA, baby. What, all the... All the explosions and freedom? We find, then we Copy that. Pull a unit at policing the jaywalkers. <laughs> Yo, for real, he hopped out like, hey, what are you doing? What are you doing there, buddy? Yo, Snoop, what up, bro? Yo, Death Wish, dude. Oh, my God. Oof, the longer the streams go. Who need that chopper? Stay low. The hard oh, what the hell? Oh. Take it out, take it out. Nice. Doors open. Taking out the control room must have shorted the locks. Stack up and sweep the building. Take out any cocaine stocks you find. There's a stockpile. Let's take it out. Was primed. All right, yo, my bugging, bro. Can somebody, can somebody rewind that twenty seconds and just tell me if I'm tired, or did that like, was he, was he like right here and I didn't see him because I'm just like, like what the hell just happened there? This place is huge, like my ex. Oh, you're a lucky man, huh? Damn, I hear lots of gunfire in the distance. Talk about doing the least work possible? <laughs> what was that referring to? Calling the rebels? Dropping mortars? I mean, that's how it's done, baby. With commandos in this bitch. Yeah, those dudes are getting murked from all... Sniper out there. No hostiles evident. Lock shorted. Let's go. Frag out. Got eyes on a cocaine stockpile. Oh my god, Weaver! <laughs> Weaver, what are you doing? <laughs> Damn, that was a shitload of pull boat we just wrecked. Somebody's gonna be pissed. This will put El Anasario's nuts in a vice. We'll have to come out of hiding to deal with the fallout, and then he's ours. No man. This is Pat Katari. The damage you've done in Okoto has made El Emisario very nervous. He's terrified of what El Yayo will think when he finds out how much production capacity has been lost. Sounds good so far. To make up the difference, El Emisario has ordered his men to take over a hospital in Okoto and convert it into a cocaine lab. Ah, uh, all of them, because I already the beat this. 
vital to the people of Okoro and to my people as well. I have sent a small force to defend the building, but it's not enough. They won't last long without help. Understood. Tell your people we're on the way. Wait, what? Love the engineers that put a, a heart covering text that I miss, I miss on? Yeah, I should have all the exo pieces. I, I already, unless, unless it's for each, um, each profile. I already beat this in ghost mode. Just never streamed it. Um. So let's see, like the helm. What is it? Facewear? Headwear? It's headwear? What is it called? I don't know if it's headwear or facewear. Let's see. They're my uh, high cut. All right. No, I guess not. All right. So I guess it's facewear. Skull bandana. Oh, there it is. Yeah, I should have it all. They should be they should be they should be good. Yo, Keegan, later, bro. While in the back, he was there crashed at the bottom of the stairs, looking up the stairs for some odd reason. Yo, bro, I'm so I'm so blind. I'm so blind, dude. I'm like, yo, what the hell? El Emissario is staging an attack on a local hospital, and Pakatari needs help to defend it. It's your call. But Look for the XO backpack. I should have it. Like I said, dude, if if unless it's save file specific, it's all unlocked. I already have every I have all this beat on my other my main file. Oh, yeah, yeah, you've seen if I had them, yeah. Now, nah, I had to wind it back to see him, yeah, but for you guys, you know, you're playing, you're watching this in 1080, you know, with a certain, certain amount of distortion from YouTube. I'm looking at this crystal clear on my computer, you know, so it's, you know, I should have seen him. Whoa, what the hell? You, whoa, what the hell? Whoa, this, whoa, look at this truck is breakdancing. What the hell? Oh, shit. 1080, I'm at 144PJ. You're crazy, dude. You are absolutely nuts. Jay, how does your yo Jay, how does your data work? Do you have a you have like a pay as you go type of plan for your phone? Coming up in the hospital now. Doesn't look like Elamasario's made his move yet. Let's find the rebel CEO and tell him we're here. Right behind you, boss. Dark, I watch you in 360. It's infinite. So wait, if you have unlimited data, why are you watching the stream in 144? Like Dark, you too. Like why are you watching in 360? Watching on a fire stick on 55 inch screen. 55 inches. 55 inches of beautifulness. You get all this beauty on your TV, Ton? That's what you're telling me? That's what you're telling me? You see all this sexiness on that big TV? I would watch myself on a big TV, too. Oh, shit. Put the hornet's nest. Put a call to the rebels for a diversion. Frag out. 
Kapitän. I think that's all of them. Stuff lag. Oh, it lags often. Cody one forty four. What the fuck? <laughs> Cocaine's a hell of a drug. Even trucks go ape shit. Yo, for real. In Bolivia, even trucks. <laughs> A little nose candy in the uh in the oil tank make trucks go crazy. <laughs> because you too ball. <laughs> Yo, but at at 1080, bro, I have more hair, dude. At 360, I have less hair. At 1080, you could uh you could uh you could see the hair. You could see the hair follicles at uh, 1080, bro. It's better. It's a lot better. He said, oh, gee, you're so sexy in 1080. I didn't know. I had no idea you was this sexy, baby. I gots to watch you in 1080 from now on. I, I gots to watch you in 1440. Please stream in 4K, baby. Can you stream in 4K for me, baby? You was too sexy not to see you in 4K. We're clear. We're clear. That was it. That was it. That was your lame attempt to kill the doctor. Oh, we're not clear. What are you Most talking about? Are oh, secure. there we go. This is Bowman. Looks like you really stirred the shit in a coral. Where did yes, ma'am. Yo, what's up, boys? Let's go. Let's go. I can probably do 40 usually, which is good enough for me, but sometimes I need to use 144. Damn, so because 36 is okay when the picture is small? So, yo, that's crazy, dude. Like, why do you. We bring him in now, he'll give up everything he knows. Give us the location, we'll take care of it. My monitor is 1440. The difference between playing and watching is laughably huge. Yeah, it is. But, yo, Jay, how come you prefer to watch in such a pixelated... Coro's a mess, and Sueño is calling for El Emisario's head. Like... Not even El Yeyo can protect him now. That's crazy that you'd sit there in 144, and it's... Isn't it so blurry to you? Somebody want to explain to me why we're extracting Re El Yo, Eagle, recently got 44 of my 1080 broken. It's freaking beautiful, yes. Yo, but, Eagle, you're... You're playing in 1440, right? I assume you're also gaming in 1440, or are you just talking about just watching shit in general? It's a mover and shaker in the cartel. You got a better idea? Sure. Leave the asshole twisting in the wind. Oh. Yeah, well, that's probably upscaled because I'm not I'm not streaming in 1440. So your your TV or whatever is upscaling the 1080 to 1440 because I'm only streaming 1080 60. Damn. When Bowman wants somebody, she gonna fuck around. You got that right. I can't read text unless it's large. So why don't you just put it to fucking 1080, you weirdo? The hell are you doing to yourself? Game of 1440, my monitor wild lens looks beautiful, man. Yeah, bro. It does. It does. 1440. For me, 1440 is the sweet spot. And it has been ever since I basically got this computer. Well, I had upgraded. Um, when 4K is a little more mainstream eagle, uh, that's when I'll do my upgrade. But until then, 1440 is a sweet spot for me, bro. They're on alert. Ah, oh, shit, we've been spotted. Like an eyes in the sniper. Bien, camarada. Congratulations on defending the hospital from a limitarius man. Couldn't have done it without you. Don't mention it, Katari. Just add it to your bill. There is one more thing. Before Lemisario's men attacked the hospital, one of my people loaded a truck with vaccines and tried to get them to safety. Unfortunately, he was stopped at the unit at checkpoint and the truck was confiscated. It's vital we get those vaccines, Yankee. The truck is at the unit at base now. I know it's asking much of Boom! 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 Let's go. Whoops, wrong button. Heads up. We've got only that patrol. 
Probably a response to all the shit we've been stirring here in Okoro. Let them kill each other. Don't shoot! Let them burn! Target spotted. Oh my god, it didn't kill him? No. He caught a cluster to the chest. Hell yeah, bro! Get some! Get some! Bro, you really thought that was cover, bro? Like, really? You thought that was cover? Nice! Assholes are coming this way. What's the plan? The plan is to kill everything. Actually, why don't you come up here? Why don't you join the fight, bro? Look at these guys just coming in. Taking over. Guys are so slow at everything. All the way back here, not even getting in the fight. We're spread out too far. On the move. I got it. I'll fly. Yo, Avery, what up? Do I cost so All right, good to go. Yo, Avery, here's the thing, right? So I was customizing everything, but then I, since it's ghost mode and you die, it doesn't save anything. Like your presets don't get saved. So for this playthrough, I, j I didn't customize. I had dope customizations too, Avery. Like we did, we looked online and we got the SOCOM customizations. I forget who wanted SOCOM. I forget who it was. Was it Snoop? I forget. We had, yo, we all looked like SOCOM characters from SOCOM 2 in the first mission. I don't know if you've ever played that game. And yeah, bro, I like... We were all decked out, and then this playthrough, I was like, yo, dude, because we kept dying. <laughs> we kept dying in ghost mode. And so to, to make the costumes over and over again, this time we we're just like, yo, whatever. Oh. Get on. Get on. Get on. Coming up on the target area now. Get ready. Bowman can't wait to take a hold up. One last bad guy. Ooh, that's close. Let's get back to it. Bowman can't wait to take a run at El Amasario. So watch your fire. You need to take no, damn it. That. I'll be damned. Ladies and gentlemen, El Amasario has left the building. Killed himself rather than face his own. It says auto 1080, but I could set it to 1440. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So if you're set in the 1440. We need to check the body. The pixels might be there, but the quality, my qu quality on my end isn't. Found El Masario. What happened? He killed himself. Left a note to El Sueño taking the blame for the loss of the labs in Okoro. Guess the shame of failing his grandfather was just too much to take. That little shit. We had El Sueño left enough. Now this. Guess he wasn't quite the fuck up we thought he was. He just didn't break the way we expected. I'm pretty literate, Jay. Not sure how it worked out. Wait, while is he default to 1440 with two times resolution? I played almost the whole campaign at point thirty three lag. Damn. You had the resolution set. Yo, <laughs> Jay. Oh my God, bro. What are you rocking, Jay? You still, let me, you still holding on to like a 1080 Ti? It's Bowman. Looks like the damage you've done to the car. Hey, squad man. Hate is gonna hate. Hate is gonna hate. Forcing the gringa and Oyayo to start cutting the purity of their- Should have been here earlier, hey, squad. We were talking about- <laughs> Hate is gonna hate. Sucks to be them. What to do for us? We got the gringa, but Sueño still needs a dog to kick. Yayo's managing production while the cartel keeps him prisoner in his own house. Who comes in and talks to We don't tolerate the rudeness. Nah, we've been good. We've been good. It's been a good. It's been a good stream. Avery, you have any suggestions? Yo, A Squad, check it, bro. Look where we're at, dude. Look where we're at. Look where we're at, bro. El Yeo's fallen out of favor with the cartel. Let's bring him in. It's time we made him an offer. Heavy G, what up, bro?
El Yayo. We're coming for you, El Yayo. 55 screen, 1440, laptop, 1080 for comments, double stats. Bro, who's living better than freaking Ton right now? This guy is absolutely balling as a, as a streamer watcher. This guy consumes content like no other. Yeah, making process. Heavy G, what's up? Yo, dude, Heavy G, we're killing it right now, bro. We are killing it. Playing ghost mode. We're getting far. We're doing well. Gonna flank around in the in the coca in the coca leaves. This is the place. We're gonna hit him. Let's take this low and slow. We're gonna hit him from the flanks. We're here. The first thing they'll do is kill El Yayo. Copy that. Oh shit, this is supposed to be a stealth mission? I thought El Yayo is not even... I forget that. I don't even remember this, to be honest. Do we... I don't remember capturing him. Do we capture him or he's like... He's like... Oh, we do... Oh, we kill him? Target killed. All right. All right. I completely forgot this mission. Might have to join in and get you in an having. Oh my God! Listen to this guy. Don't even put that into the universe, dude. The wife likes the live streams. Otherwise, I have to wait till till uh till um. Damn it! Freaking YouTube, man. That heart. I can't see that one word. Let's see, let me move it up. At work. Oh, okay. Hey, squad, finally about to step up to the plate. Nah, he's busy. Only that chopper. Stay low. Heads up, hospitals in the area. I got a narco over here outside the hacienda. Faction warfare? Wait, what? There's no rub. There's no rebels anywhere. No rebels. Yeah, well, Rally up, group up. Oh my God! You know, stupid, you fucking bitch. What the hell is going on here? Holt, why are you coming from that way, bro? What is wrong with you? Did Holt, did Holt run all the way around and get in a firefight on his own? I'm pretty sure that's what just happened. Damn it. That's, that's, that's mission failed. Oh, maybe not. There we go. Oh, 
Oh, I, I guess not. <clears throat> You guys all good? Damn, I love this job. Vamanos, taking you someplace safe. Damn, bro. If the Sueños men see that I'm God, the cartel will kill my family. It's been so long, I don't remember this. Why you kill Abuelita? <laughs> PID is foreign term to G, but she got fired. Yo, what is that? Yeah, it is. It is, bro. Yeah, yo, Heavy Jeep, right? That's why Holt's crippled forever and Weaver's dead, bro. Because these guys keep doing stupid shit like that, bro. Like, jeez. Oh, shit. Ooh, nice. I should have known. CIA has brought in her own sicarios. Oh. Bolivar said the United States was destined to plague the Americas with misery. Now that misery is upon my house. He says Sueño has his family. It is bullshit. You could have led with that. These four gunfighters are your best last hope at saving your family. So are you gonna play ball or are you gonna bury more kin? Oh, positive identification. I decide if I will talk. Nah, yo, she was positively identified as a Sicario, bro. And she got what she rightfully deserved. Yayo's family's in the cartel district of a village called Baya Floresta. We've got to move fast. So when you find I'll take King Slayer team any day, baby. Any day of the week, twice on Sunday. Locate Chua and Rosa. Oh, I remember this. This is they're like locked up and shit, right? Oh, this is this is done. Mira por acá. Yeah, <laughs> you're fired. Look alive, we got company. Oh, and then she was killing with the, was the kitchen. Well, I don't know what she was doing out of it then, Lucko. <laughs> I only make love. I, only, I don't make war, I make love. The secret recipe dies with her. Damn, should have had her write it down before I... uh. Sent it to, um, Santa Muerte. That guy was a scout. He was a watch. I could tell. I could, I could, I know these things. There's your PID right there, Jay. I PID that guy as a scout. Time to party. Frag out. 
Esta me mierda, culeros. Where is he running to? Huh? Go. Where is he running to? Roger that. Keep moving. Frag out. Yo, I would love to see these rebels just blasting civilians, bro. That shit would be so awesome. Keep moving. Roger. What's going on out there? My guest is getting antsy. You find Yayo's family? We're working on it. Understood. Just hurry, okay? It's gonna be damned ironic if the dude has a coronary waiting for his wife and son. Roger that. Heads up. I got eyes on Yayo's wife and son. Pero Dios mío, muchos sicarios leave us alone. Take it easy. What? Do I look like a sicario? Don't touch. Oh, you're lucky. I don't wanna. You're lucky. I don't wanna play this mission again. Otherwise, I would shoot you in the head. Now follow me. Both packages secure. Let's get them back to their old man. So I'm reaching for a, yo, spec, exactly. You saw it, I saw it, we saw it, right? You saw him reaching for his cell phone. Nice, blast him. This is the old man's fault, isn't it? He's too greedy and too proud. A man cannot be both. Callate, mijo. Rudy does his best for his- This is it, you're safe now. Extract, wait, what? Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, man, only one of them got on. I'll pilot. Let's go, let's go. Oh, wait. Let's get back to business. Oh, never mind. Looks like he spawned. Rudy does his best for oh, oh, wait, wait, what? You know what? Come on, bro, you can make it. You can make it. <laughs> what a loser. <laughs> Come on, bro. Hurry up. You can make it. Let's go, bro. Come on. You can do it. You can do it. Look, Jay, third person. Yeah, you made it. <laughs> Yo, bro. Straight up left his ass. Rodolfo. <laughs> Yo, heavy. <laughs> Immersive. Don't expect us to believe that. Instead, He's getting that cardio in, bro. To Bolivia. I may be too young to have marched with the Compañeros in 96, but I have seen the scars on the protesters who were beaten. I'll oh, man. I'm sick oh, we eat a dick. Bullshit. We're not your enemy, kid. But you're not our friend either. Tranquilo, mijo. I have made deals with many devils in my time, and it has always been to protect my family, to ensure that my people, los Cocaleros, survive. Now I have made my deal with you, Agent Bowman. I'm sure to regret it later, but for now, you will allow us to see another day. <laughs> Stupid ass kid. Oh, that's why watch him get run down. Just <laughs> get your whole ton imagine. <laughs> oh shit. Yeah, looks that way. They know we saved their Burn fatties burning them calories, bro. Hell of a time making cocaine without El Yayo. The rest is over my pay grade. I heard that. We should be able to install dating apps in Wildlands and then kidnap the dates for Intel. <laughs> what? The <f> <laughs> Yo, 
Yo, Heavy G, he was reaching. He was reaching. He was reaching for that cell phone. It'd be interesting if you could search their bodies and find incriminating evidence on some of them. That would, yo, that would be cool, right? Like, it's like a little nonchalant detail that wouldn't really mean much, but it would be kind of cool. But then, then you'd have players, like you would have to have a specific type of civilian, and then you would know that you could always kill that civilian type instead of just letting it be random. Where if you kill, I mean, that's why the honor system kind of worked in Red Dead. Because it, it, you know, it puts you on one side of the honor or not. Because otherwise, how do you, how do you make it to where you're killing civilians? Like, what's the pros and the cons other than you find something or then you're, you're just out here killing every civilian. See if you could find something. So, all right, let's see. Um, Wow. So, Itako. Wow, we gotta do Itako to get Muro. And then we have to do, yes, Agua de Verde to get the Cardinal. And then he'll open up. El Comandante, something on his own. We don't even really need him. And yeah, yo. We are getting there, peeps. We are absolutely getting there. Shout out to all of you sexy bastards out there, especially the ones who are subscribed to my OnlyFans. And uh, yeah, that's it for today. Amazing stream. A little three and a half hour stream on this beautiful Wednesday. And uh, we're going to end it there. We are going to pick up uh, tomorrow. I got to do some things after work tomorrow. So maybe the stream might be a little later or I just might take off and then hop in on Friday. So I'll let, I'll let you guys know if you don't, you know, see anything pop up by like, like three, four or five o'clock. That means, uh, I got, I got too busy. I got to do some things after work. So <laughs> heavy G bro. I just got here. <laughs> Yo, heavy G man. I'm sorry, brother. You know, it's like, it's six here. By the time I get off, I eat some dinner, I relax. I, you know, I got to go to bed. I get up. I got to get up early in the morning. So got to eat dinner, relax for a little bit. Tomorrow's another day. Friday's another day. Bro, we just, we keep it going. We keep it going. And that's it. You know, you got a date with democracy on Friday. Oh, Spec. Look at Spec trying to twist. He's like, don't, don't do... Don't finish Wildlands. Come on, democracy. Yo, you know what, Spec? May tomorrow, yo, Spec. Actually, tomorrow might be a better day for for democracy. I'm I'm gonna hit you up tomorrow. Because by the time I get home, I might it might be too late for me to stream, but it might be a perfect time for us to hop on Hell Divers and just hang out and kick it. Yo, Cody, bro, thanks for stopping by, man. I appreciate it. I appreciate all you sexy bastards stopping by hanging out making the stream fun and uh yeah so stop by uh stop by the next time i stream and we will probably finish if we survive we'll finish ghost mode i'm really not looking forward to that sueño mission though because i guess you know what maybe i'll just cheese it maybe i'll cheese the sueño mission just finish it and then Next time A Squad hops on, we can try to do it together. Because that's going to be tough, man. I only really only cheese that. I always just fly the helicopter right in, hop out, and run straight to Swan, yo. <laughs> yo, spec salute, brother. Have one of the J. Stay strapped. Stay strapped or clap. Stay safe, G. Yo, heavy G, my brother. Disconnecting, reconnecting. Are we back? We back? Reconnection is successful. All right, we caught a little... We caught a little lag spike there, but um, yeah, I'll be back. Maybe not tomorrow, or uh, maybe Friday. We'll see what's up. Uh, all depending on what I do tomorrow. So, guys, I'm out of here. Peace out. Love you, sexy bastards. Subscribe to my OnlyFans. And um, I'm out of here, guys. Everybody have a good night. Peace out.